One year has passed since resettlement of the residents of Berezovka and Bestow villages in West Kazakhstan region. Decision on resettlement was made by the ROK government due to the expansion of the sanitary protection zone around Karachaganak oil and gas condensate field. All resettlement costs were borne by KPO. At the end of 2017, all 454 families moved to new apartments and houses in Aksai and adjacent Adeltal micro district. The settlement process was carried out in two phases. Socially vulnerable community groups were resettled first to Aksai at the end of 2015. Pensioners and people with disabilities have chosen their future places of residence themselves. They were provided with apartments in multi-storey blocks of apartments in micro districts four and five. KPO and Akimat resettled us into this nice house. We moved in phase one. The place where we live is very good and we are very grateful for such an apartment. A new life has started with the move. I am now working at kindergarten number six. All is good. People here are good. Thank you very much. The rest of the residents of Berezovka and Bestow villages left their homes during phase two of resettlement in 2017. They were also offered to choose where to live. In detached houses with land plots in Araltal micro district at a distance of five kilometers from Aksai, or in nine multi-story blocks of apartments in micro district Karachaganak 1 in Aksai. Or they could get cash compensation for houses in Berezovka and Bestow villages. It should be noted that KPO went beyond the resettlement of community members. The company regularly monitors the resettled house households at their new location of residence. A grievance procedure was developed for resettled residents. According to this procedure, residents of Araltal and those living in the two nine multi-storey apartment blocks in Aksai can contact community liaison specialists directly with their grievances. As part of the grievance procedure, the residents of micro district Araltal requested KPO to provide fertile soil for their land plots. The management of KPO satisfied this request and each household was provided with fertile soil. 100 detached houses were built in micro district Araltal. These are 50 three room houses with a floor area of 95 square meters and 54 room houses with a floor area of 105 square meters. Families that wanted to live on the land and engage in gardening chose to move to Aratal. I would like to thank KPO Company Management for the opportunity to grow old in good conditions, in a beautiful warm house, in comfort, with all amenities and a large land plot. We have been living in Aratal for a year now. Our two kids were also born here. A new life has started here for me, and we are settling down very slowly, building out buildings. We built a sauna and garages for our homes. We also started growing crops in our garden this year. The resident of Araltal would like to thank KPO for the generosity and for the provision of black soil to our community. Everything was unexpected and a bit scary. When the first snow fell, we had some issues with the roof. Nevertheless, thank God, everything was fixed this summer. The roof was repaired. One year has passed since the resettlement. The problems of the people are gradually being resolved. People are settling down in new places. The resettled residents in Aratal have built outbuildings in their yards and started growing vegetables in their gardens and raised poultry. Many of the residents harvested vegetables this autumn. In short, life goes on. Carriage Agnac TV reported.